hello guys this is ricky from vacant wallet in this video we'll talk about a new method through which you can actually group your apps in an efficient way here you can see that uh, the grouping of google apps and then mi apps is done in a specific manner as it comes by default and here i have a transfer apps then i have tools then i have shopping then i have learning apps obviously and then i have travel apps and obviously remote app pro photography apps and then audio editing apps and of course the service provider app now these are like okay sort of stuff but we'll take it to next level and uh, to do that firstly we have to install a google actually what we call it google keyboard that is gboard from uh, google play store so let me search for it google keyboard you have to search only for google keyboard i have installed it previously already i have it installed in my phone so you can install it gboard and then you have to select gboard as your default uh, keyboard you can search uh, google and google that and then you have to edit the header of the groups app here i click on emoji then i search emoji here here i have to like name the group as something particular as google it is actually not good the eyes are not good so i looked for uh, another thing google makes uh, play sort of stuff so i looked for play stuff so search for play and then i select this play button for google apps so it's okay similarly you can also categorize your apps with these images or emojis here i will use some sort of chinese because emma is a chinese company so i'll use chinese some emoji chinese sort of stuff here i use this uh, chinese actually it is not chinese it is japanese symbol okay no problem but looks like chinese to me then we're going to next here i have transfer apps so we send or receive items through these uh, transfer apps so i'll search some sort of download okay nothing comes up uh, transfer okay nothing comes up then send let's see yeah that's the last one is good okay that will do fine and then for shopping apps uh, i will search uh, like something like cart okay yeah here yeah, i have shopping cart that is good that is good uh, for tools uh, we will use some sort of uh, keyboard like uh, uh, repair okay let's see tools okay yeah tools here is, this is good this is good then for learning apps uh, we will use some sort of uh, keyword keywords like uh, student okay degree i think learn okay, student yeah student v as a cap no 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 hey let's search for cap yeah cap is good here yeah, it's a cap okay convocation you put on this cap travel for travel apps you have to use like uh, travel um, road i think i should so yeah that is good the second last one is good for me i love for this okay fine then tv for tv remote self i think tv is the best keyboard to search as uh, emoji yeah it is good then for photography apps obviously we will search for camera emoji yeah select anyone you think good uh, it's okay camera is good okay fine camera works fine here then for audio editing apps obviously you should search something like okay fine. something like uh, audio oh my bad you search emoji audio yeah it will do fine then for service 
provide this aisle types emoji type such as network node service provider towers not fine actually i have used that before service yeah that's there here service four tower symbol is here okay i'll use from the previously used ones but it comes under service providers actually okay that is fine so in this way you can group your apps efficiently and you have apps as a symbol then they group as a symbol representing the whole plan of apps so similarly you can do this for stock android also i'll show that later on in this video but you can see that it's pretty efficient for stock android you can change the launcher i'm gonna go for google launcher and it will be the default layout for stock android actually you can only group apps on home screen on stock android but not in the what we call app drawer so here i have google apps i can actually rename it rename the whole group as uh, what we call play some sort of play button i think because google is known for its state of the art techniques okay this i'll use okay it works fine similarly you can like combine or club the shopping apps and then rename that group app groups as a cart something you can show as it's shopping cart or shopping and you can also use two symbols instead of using one which will which will give it a pretty look so yeah two symbols can also be used yeah this is it hope you like the video and if you think that it is good do like share and subscribe this is ricky from vacant wallace signing off